Rainwater Harvesting Part 4 Impact of One Person It is hard to imagine that one person can make a difference in protecting and conserving fresh water supplies on this planet, but each individual can really help the environment. Rain barrels and rain storage tanks are becoming increasingly popular for collecting rooftop runoff. The rain that lands on top of the roof is collected via the use of a gutter system and funneled into barrels or holding tanks. This water can be used for all non-potable uses or filtered to be used as a potable water source. Potable water, once used in sinks and baths, is called gray water. This gray water can be recycled and used for sewage water, also known as black water. It is also possible to reuse the gray water by filtering and treating it to be used as potable water once again. You can help the environment by changing what you use. Replace shower heads and faucet aerators with water efficient models. This can save from 2 to 19 liters or 1 half to 5 gallons of water per minute. Use a water-filled milk jug or plastic bottle in your toilet tank to displace water. This allows your toilet to operate using less water. You can save 4 liters or 1 gallon of water each time you flush. Another option would be to replace your old toilet tank with a more modern one that can save 8 liters or 2 gallons per flush. Use a broom instead of water to clean your driveway or garage. Be sure to not sweep debris into the street or storm sewer. Put a spray nozzle on the end of your garden hose for car washing and plant watering to control the amount of water used. Use native plants in your garden that require less water. Use cat litter or sand instead of salt on icy walks. Salt pollutes water and kills plants. Change what you do. Do not let the water run while brushing your teeth or washing your face. This can save up to 19 liters or 5 gallons. Do not leave the water running if you wash dishes by hand. Rinse all of your dishes at once by using a dish rack placed in the sink. Only run your dishwasher and washing machine when they are full. Dispose of tissues, dead insects, and other waste in a trash can rather than a toilet. Improve your housekeeping. Fix leaks by replacing faucet washers and toilet flappers as needed. A slow drip or leak can easily waste more than 379 liters or 100 gallons of water per week which leads to an unnecessarily high water or electricity bill. Educate others. Educate your community about the effects of dumping waste such as pesticides down drains and into waterways. Encourage your neighbors, family, and friends to install low flow water fixtures and to practice water conservation. Here are some of the ways that you can get involved. Become an activist for rainwater harvesting. Get involved with the Global Water School at the Bara TR Community Center in India. Go to liftkids.org, check out the site, and make an online donation or get involved to help a sustainable water harvesting village.